So you want to kill ghosts, but you're on a budget? I have the perfect setup for you. And this setup, I got to tell you, dude, it is cracked. I honestly did not think it was going to be any good, but it turned out to be so good. All right. So for the ghost setup, I'm using full Mastiff with a pooch sword. It is that simple. Now I'm going to go through the prices real quick and break it down and just show you how cheap it is. Mastiff crown. I paid 1.28 million for this and I added bank five. Massive chest plate, I paid 1.4 million and I also added bank five. Massive leggings, 1.24 million and I also added bank five. And Mastiff Boots, 1.17 million, and I added Bank 5. I added Bank 5 to the armor so I could help make some more coins while doing this. You can see Bank 5 adds 2.5 coins for each enemy killed, and I have that on four pieces of armor, so that's an extra 10 coins. And for the Pooch Sword, it is not recombobulated. It only has hot potato books, no fumings. I added a gemstone slot, which costs about 1.2 million plus the gemstone. I added a fine Jasper, which was really cheap and one for all now i will do a little disclaimer here one for all is not the best option for this bruh fallen star you're gonna really interrupt me right now bro optimally you would have an enchanted pooch sword with looting four on it you see looting increases the chance bro see looting four increases the chances of a monster dropping an item by 60 percent, which really helps your rates when you're ghost grinding but just for the uh, purpose of this video i'm gonna be using a one for all pooch sword so keep that in mind so you can see here that the ability of the pooch sword you deal an extra damage per 50 max health and you can see with this setup i have 57,000 max health alexa 57,000 divided by 50 57,000 divided by 50 is 1,140 that's an extra 1,140 damage just with 57,000 health so when it comes to my magical power i am opting to use warrior with crit damage tuning the reason i'm not using hurtful which apparently seems to be the best or the one that i have the best luck with is because I have a thousand magical power and most of you guys will not have a thousand magical power if you're watching this guide. So I'm assuming that you're going to be able to get a bonus 300 crit damage. Honestly, the higher the better. So try hurtful out because you can see the more crit damage you have, you get more health. Gain 50 hearts per one crit damage. So yeah, just a little disclaimer. I'm going to be using warrior, but you really should be using hurtful. And for the pet, I'm going to be using a level 100 mithril golem. You can see the bonus of the mithril golem. You get 20% more combat stats when you're on mining islands. And this is a mining island. I almost forgot to mention that you should be using Ancient on your Mastiff stuff. Um, the requirement for Ancient, I believe, is Mining Level 30. Um, it's not too hard to get. Just use Snow Minions. Or you can have someone apply it for you, but be careful. You don't want to get scammed, even though this stuff isn't worth too much. So yeah, just be careful when dealing with other players and having them apply stuff for you. Alright, with that out of the way, I'm going to hop down again and try this out. Let's see how much damage. 500,000?! I'm dealing almost 500,000, dude! What?! The Mithril Golem really helps out too. I want to see what it would do without the Mithril Golem. Uh, let's see. We'll just pull out something that doesn't do any more damage like a Guardian. 250k. The Mithril Golem is contributing 200,000 damage to this. Yeah, 450k. You can grind these pretty easily. And if you have a little bit better of a magical power, you can definitely get this up to a two hit. I'm currently doing a three hit kill. But I'll show you, for example, if you have like a thousand magical power, which if you have a thousand magical power, you're most likely not running around in Mastiff Armor. If I put this on Hurtful... I am doing 917,000 damage, dude. I'm almost one-shotting ghosts in Mastiff armor. Three magic find from my Grandma Wolf. That is also a very good thing to have when you are grinding ghosts as a Grandma Wolf pet. You get the kill combos and you are... Uh... Look at that! Sorrow! Let's go! Wait, how much is that even worth? 400k? Wait, that's actually... Wait, that's actually good. If you can get Sorrow often? I don't know much about ghost grinding. I'm not going to lie. I'm just showing you how to kill him, bro. Another good part about this setup is that it's also really hard to die in. You gotta like really try to die. Like you gotta find a big group of them and just try and die. Anyway, thank you guys so much for watching that video. I hope you learned something from it and I hope I was able to help you kill some ghosts. If you do not mind, press the like button and subscribe. I got some more videos in the works. You should also join my Discord server because I'll be giving away some stuff in there in the giveaways channel. Make sure you go to the role selector and select the giveaway notification rule. And you might as well select the upload notification rule too while you're there. Wink, wink. Anyway, see you guys in the next video. Goodbye. Hello, my name is Mr. Sexy Jura, and I just beamed you. You are not getting money back. <laughs> Get out of my way. I have to scam more people. Thank you.